Uh, hello everybody, today's recap, November 9th. Let's see uh, what happened today. First thing in the morning I posted this. This was um, at 8.48 a.m. I mentioned gold and silver are at reversal uh, level, which I uh, was able to find since yesterday, but it was hovering around my entries. So I mentioned uh, to everybody that gold could, uh, could come back down, but I don't have safe stops. The price was about, what, um, 50 points risk, uh, 30 points risk, that, that's a lot, but you know, um, I pointed to the gold uh, to be reversal, I said uh, 1720, my stops are above 1720, I cannot trade it. Same thing with the uh, silver, I mentioned uh, this is the gold, I mentioned it's coming back down for a big move, and I have silver too coming back down from 2.5 level, 21.5 level, which I, since yesterday, I actually, if you look at silver, I mentioned silver, we have a 2.21.5 since yesterday, as you see this, it was there. So uh, I ended up uh, just, um, you know, giving directional call on the gold, and if you see gold, um, this was the level that I called, it could bring it down, but I don't have stops. I don't have, my stop loss will be above 1722 or 1720. And look, it poked, and then it came back down. So gold reacted nicely, silver reacted even uh, uh, nicer to the move. This is silver, as you see, but I did not call the trades. What I called today, I called the YM. And this is the exact call. Um, uh, the market was very hesitant all morning until after 10 a.m. Um, I, I did my top-down analysis. This was my view on the uh, uh, YM since last week. That's going to crash uh, from this level here. It crashed last week and again went back to it, but it was crashing again. In my opinion, I saw it. It was coming. So I called it uh, after I saw some confirmations. Um, I, we don't do random calls. I don't do random calls. It has to be anticipated ahead of time. So I said YM resistance at 33075, which is just where the line is, this line here. And I called it short. I said 33060 or better, short. And that was, I, I, I gave a note at 1009. Of course, everybody's prepared already because I'm doing a live room. And at uh, at 10.11, I not only called it in the room, I also posted it, and I said, take first target 10 to 15 ticks on the first two contracts. Why? First two contracts to take first target, today was ideal for taking first target as a scalp, to make sure that you get something in your hand. For example, if you take 15 ticks, we took more because the first target was big, I mean, the first move was big, uh, but let's say you took 15 ticks on the first two, that means you have 30 ticks in your favor. So if your stop loss get hit, gets hit after, you're safe, especially in a day like this. But uh, you know, the market hovered. Look at look at what happens. And and then I gave them another another um, you know uh, time I, for another time. I gave them the new stop, and then I gave them the final target. Watch this. Touched exactly the line. We took first target, and if anybody missed it, they had a chance to take it again. The stop loss was 33,100, as you see, and then the market moved down. The, the great part about this, if you see this, sorry about that, if you see this, uh, final target, 32,730. Folks, that is 331 ticks, or 330 ticks profit if we hit it. And if you look at the market today, Watch this. Let me go all the way to the, to the final. This was the target. 32730 here. It, it, it came back lower after, but this was my target, right here. So 330 tick. Now, I, I I think I exited a bit earlier than that. However, I just mentioned to everybody before I left my station, I said if anybody's keeping the YM, we have a support at 2:53 a.m. The market was here, uh, actually here. I said we have support on YM. Careful, don't hold it beyond that. It might be a big support. I said the support between 32520, which is this line, and uh, 32450, which is the lower line. And did you see where the market closed? Now we are 4.44 p.m., so the market is closed. You see where the market closed. 
So today alone, with with after you know being very careful, I was able to manage one trade call that I called to for my members, and we got uh, um, about uh, let me see, I got 230 ticks because I got I got out a bit early, but anybody held it, they got more than 330 ticks, just on the runner alone. Okay, thank you. Hopefully, we'll see you in our trials. 